Which you guys got another video here for you on tools to customize your Windows 11 or Windows 10. Now, if you like customizing and tweaking your version of Windows, then this video is for you. You can use the Major Geeks Windows Tweaker, and this is an early version, but basically it's a, a collection of all the registry tweaks that they've uh, compiled on their website, and they've put them into one little area which you can use a program to run. So you've got your context menu here. These are all your context menu tweaks. These are going to be registry files and other types of files like batch files and things like that. You can see here we do have disabled features. There's a bunch of disabled features in here. So if you're one of these people that don't like a lot of bloat and a lot of stuff running on your system, you can use something like this to make it a lot easier. I've added a couple of extra tweaks in here to show you. You can add your own tweaks into this. You can see it does come with a gaming tweak, but I've added a uh, gaming tweaks folder in here with some extra added uh, batch files and other programs that you can use to uh, tweak Windows if you want to tweak it for gaming and things like that. But there is other things in here which you can use as well. So let me go ahead and open the application up and you'll see exactly what it looks like. It's quite a nice, simple little program. And all it's doing is basically listing all of the stuff in that folder. So basically all of the folders will be listed in here and they're all categorized. You can see it does show the actual registry file on the bottom here. So depending on what registry tweaks you want to run, whether it'll be networking, whether it be gaming, file explorer, uh, delete files and folders, context menu, all that sort of stuff, you can run them from here. Maybe you've got a power plan that you like running. Maybe you have your own registry tweaks that you want to add to this. You can add them to your own folder and they will populate inside here and you'll be able to run them. You can see here the context menu does have quite a few little tweaks in here. So all you need to do here, it does come with a few gaming ones on here, but if you follow one of your favorite YouTubers on YouTube that comes with his own uh, tweaking pack, you can always add that to this particular list if you're one of those people that like to tweak Windows with all of these tweaks that are out there on the internet. So personally, um, if you're looking for a tool that organizes it in this manner, it's going to make it easy, especially if you do a lot of tweaking on a lot of computers. Uh, you can open this up and quickly run it. You can drop this on your flash drive, and that way it makes it portable, so you can uh, basically run it on different computers and uh, tweak your computer the way you like it. So again, this does come with some uh, basic tweaks on here, but if you want to add your own tweaks, like I said, Windows Defender tweaks, or networking tweaks or whatever it is you want to add in there, your privacy stuff. I've added those in there. There's quite a few and you could just run these and they will obviously make changes to the registry. So always back up your registry before you make changes and always make a system restore point before you start messing around with your computer. If you don't know what these are, then it's probably best to leave well alone and leave it to people that like to do that sort of stuff. So I've got some files in here as well. I might even zip this file up and upload it somewhere so you can download it with some of the stuff I've got once I've finished it, and you'll be able to download uh, the ones with all the stuff that I use myself, and plus some other bits that you might want to use. But I might even make my own little program like this to compile all my own little tweaks that I like to use, uh, rather than using someone else's and compiling my stuff in with theirs, uh, rather than doing that. And that way it will be my own little uh, application. But other than that, you can see here, there's quite a few uh, power tweaks in here. Uh, that come with the actual program itself. And there's some networking stuff on here as well. Now, I know a lot of gamers like to tweak their network settings, and there's plenty of that stuff out there on the internet that say tweak your network settings. And we get them coming on Discord, and they generally have broken their computer where they can't use their internet properly anymore because they've been tweaking away and they don't understand what it's doing, and they end up uh, breaking stuff. So be very careful when you're messing around with a lot of stuff inside here. There's also some other C MD tweaks in here. These are batch files. You can just click on these and they will run. As you can see here, I'll just quickly show you. And uh, this is on a virtual machine, by the way. So I'm not just clicking on any old stuff on my real PC. This is on a virtual machine that I'm running these just to show you. But again, you can add these in and uh, pretty much tweak to your art's content. Anyway, I think that is going to be about it. Pretty much covered everything I can on here. So Basically, the rule of thumb is you can download their program. It does have a bunch of tweaks already in there, but you can also add in your own tweaks to it. And that's pretty much it in a nutshell, really. Anyway, hope this video has been some sort of use to you. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out 
to all my YouTube members who have joined my YouTube members group. I really do appreciate the support. Also, if you want to chat, I'll be on the Discord server or I'll catch you in the very next video. Thanks again for watching and thanks for your continued support. I shall catch you in the next one. Bye for now.